When I was 10 years old, as an early birthday present, my dad went to Blockbuster and rented a game of my choice. Before he left, he asked what game I wanted. And in my excitement, I told him, Gundam. He smiled, he said okay, he left, and after what seemed like hours had finally passed, when he came back, he smiled and gave me this. And I was like, Dad, this is not Gundam. And he told me, yeah, I know. But they didn't have Gundam. Someone keeps renting it out. And the cashier said this was the next closest thing. So I quietly smiled and took the game from his hand. I was a bit sad, but I also knew my dad traveled really far and genuinely tried his best. And I didn't want to be an ungrateful little shit. So to make sure that we got our money's worth, I popped in the CD. And as a 10-year-old kid who had never played the PlayStation 2 before, here is literally what my first two minutes of experience looked like. When the intro was over, I turned to my dad, whose eyes were just as wide as mine from being overwhelmed with the new technology, and said, You know what, Dad? This is better than Gundam. Thank you. And he gave me a hug, and just happily and quietly sat beside me and watched me dive headfirst into a game like a wild young pup. And from that moment on, I decided this was the game. I wanted to master this. Whatever this was, it was too cool not to play. I played this game nearly exclusively until I finally beat it with 100% all parts, cleaned out the shop, 100% all parts unlocked, all missions, defeated every single pilot in the arena, and when it was finally over, I played it competitively wherever I went. Now I'll say this with quotes because outside of Japan, Armor Core never really got popular enough to have a competitive scene, but whatever semblance of a tournament there was, I went to every gathering, every party, every couch, any competition, any money match with whoever was willing, and I got pretty damn good. At the height of the PS2 era, when it came to Armored Core, I was undefeated within the entire state. And to this day, I've actually never dropped a single game in a competitive match. Now some fans love Armored Core for the deep levels of customization. Some love it for robots, some love it for story, but I love it for the fun. The combat and the gameplay is what I live for. And recently, there's a lot of expert Armored Core channels out there that talk about the lore, the development, the easter eggs, and all the cool stuff, but I don't really see a lot of channels talk about it from a competitive arena experience, or from the perspective of a game developer. 
So as someone who played this game competitively, I feel like I have some insight that I can share with you about Armored Core and from software that you probably won't have heard from other people before. So if you join me next video, I'll tell you why the gameplay for Armored Core is genius and why so many fans love it. In the meanwhile, I hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you guys.